Welcome to this cast the game played by John versus Ravnak. Spawning at six o'clock, we have John playing as the Russians versus Ravnak playing as the Indians. This map is Pripyat Marshes. There are two train post lines, one at the top, the other at the bottom. This map has some native train posts where you can make some skirmishers, some cav, and also you could make some cav archers and lancers. In the middle of the map, there's a lot of these sort of like ponds that you cannot build buildings on top, so land is quite scarce in the middle. Uh, also, there's no fish, so of course you cannot go sea booming. Uh, in the middle, there's some hunts, some trees, but there's no coin mines. The coin mines are scattered everywhere on the map except the middle. So, controlling the sides, you could get the coin mines, and also you could like secure the train posts, and you could spam some very powerful native. Alright, let's check their decks. Very standard deck. There's uh, two cap cards in H2 and one Australia card. You might rush in H2. Alright, let's check Revnak. Revnak is at 10 10. Let's see. He hasn't chosen his deck yet. Okay, he's aging out with the Karnimata. Okay, he's still not rebuilding his deck. Okay. He's going 10 10. Wood trickle. Alright, let's check from his point of view. Scattering this 45 XP treasure. He hasn't scouted the enemy's board base or anything. He got the line of sight for only at his base. Alright, let's check the opponent. He's going 14 builds, I guess. 14 builds each up. Aging up with the Quartermaster, that's 400 wood. Alright, let's check Revnak. He's got a lot of H3 cards. He might do a timing push in H3. He's dropping down a TP. Let's remove the Punk of War. John setting a 4 villager up. What is he doing with it? Okay, he's dropping down a blockhouse. Setting a second villager. Okay, so we might see some early aggression, rushing. Alright, let's check on the other side. It's dropping down a stable, 7, 700 wood. Alright, his explorers have scouted the blockhouse, so he knows the opponent is gonna rush. Training some calf sours. Sours will counter those shredlets. Like you can expect Russia to spam shredlets, so sours will definitely counter. All right, just picking up a 700 wood. Building some walls. Very good. Deleting those pillars, saving those. Wood. 
each pillar is worth 5 wood, so that he saved 15 wood there. He's got 4 hours out. Okay, 5 Cossacks. This is from the card. It's got an early market. Alright, so the sour is. They have spotted the carcass and then he's getting on top of the bills. Sniped one bill. Second bill, will he get it? Meanwhile, Russia is pushing in with Jellets, Cossacks. Very nice body block there, blocking the path. The, the Cossacks cannot raid it on this side. Very good. The sour is coming back. Sandwiching these Cossacks. Also getting on top of the Strelitz. Sours are like... Are like so Lancer units. They have like... Well, not, not entirely Lancer units. They have uh, bonus damage, damage against infantry. They're sort of like... Chanakos. Alright, he made a consulate. Training some delis. Sours, delis. Sending the big wood trickle. Alright, Russian player is switching to musketeers to deal with the, the cav. Alright, very good. Ravnak using TC fire. Alright, Sours getting on top. He doesn't care about the musketeers, he just lands right up there. Very beautiful. Delis. These are consulate delis. Because they're from the consulate. So they have a bonus hit points and bonus damage than regular delis. So they did a lot of damage there. And the Russian musketeers, they are cheaper. And also they are weaker than a regular musketeer. So a regular musketeer has 23 range damage, this one has 18. And they have the regular ones have 150 HP. The Russian ones have 120 HP. So they are quite weak. But that's their only unit to counter cabin H2, so that's their best bet. Where it gets sniped that. Explorer, cost 45 XP there. Sniping this villager as well. Another group. It's got like three groups raiding. Catching these stragglers. Picking them off one by one. Very beautiful there. <laughs> so who is countering who is? The musketeers are supposed to be anti cap But these cab just have so much damage upward. That they just overwhelm the uh, musketeers. Oh, there's four or five bills there. Getting on top. You could kill a few before pulling back. There we go. There we have it. That's the GG. Let's check the stats. Even with the starting with 1010, he still has a pretty good eco after it with those uh, double wood trickles a lot of kills from the cow mostly the kills are on the strelets and the villagers yeah he aged up at around 3.44 That's around almost like one minute earlier than his opponent Very decent eco There we have it